This evening, the city of Columbus came together for a rally in support of the Asian community. The event comes after an 18-year-old IU Bloomington student was stabbed in the head earlier this month. The court documents say the crime was racially motivated. Tonight, Fox 59's Kaylee Schuyler takes us to today's rally. Tonight, residents in Columbus are demanding change. I ask you to check your assumptions about Asian people living in your communities. Community leaders hosted a rally against Asian hate after an 18-year-old was stabbed as she got off at a bus stop. It broke our heart. And this is next door. The suspect, 56-year-old Billy Davis, told police she targeted the student due to her, quote, being Chinese. We have struggles all the time, right? So just normal people. So. It doesn't mean we look different and then we are different. We are the same. Sadly, it seems these incidents are not occurring less frequently. Ah, Papa President Linda Schur says the first step to stop the hate is conversation. We think we got to talk about it. We need to tell people that we cannot tolerate this. Ray Zhu attended the rally with her seven and four year old daughters. We're trying to uh, give more Asian culture uh, to the people living in this country. She hopes efforts like this creates a change that her kids will see. When they grow up, they, they will have a better world. Violence has happened all around the world. Speakers all agree that community members have to join in on the fight against injustice. I ask when you see something, to say something and to do something. And we are so thankful that you are here today doing something and showing up for us. Connecting, act, say something. In Columbus, Kaylee Schuyler, Fox 59 News. The 18-year-old IU student was stabbed seven times as she was just getting off of the bus. And last week, attorneys for the suspect filed a notice of insanity defense. Court documents say Billy Davis admitted to, admitted to stabbing this 18-year-old and targeting her because she believed the student was Chinese. Now, Davis's attorneys have filed a motion to determine competency. A judge requested she undergo mental health evaluations.